Hello and welcome back with yours in Demonicness Hellfire. Now I said I'm going to start vlogging so that's what this is. Just ignore the mess behind me. I can see the cameras picking up a little bit. That's, I've just got a lot going on at the moment and yeah my room with a tape needs tidying up. Slowly getting there but until this weekend's over and done with that's not likely to happen. Um, so first vlog, here we go starting. Um, it's actually been the first month where I've not been at college. Broke up last month, so this is bit, this is the June vlog. Um, broke up at the end of May. Um, it's kind of been a bit weird with not having college, and but kind of. Also, I've been doing nothing at home. I've been helping out with mum's business. She's a dance teacher. I've been getting on with other things. And we've got a dance showcase this weekend, been getting ready for that. Um, so I won't say I've not been busy, I've had quite a lot on, but it's not felt the same without having an actual thing that I've had to go to. And those who have been there, who are there, probably know what I mean. But I think it's made all the more bigger by the fact that other people are going to uni and I've just kind of said, now nah, I'm afraid I'm not interested in giving myself 36 grand of debt for four more years of sitting behind the desk. Just not interested, so that's kind of been a bit weird. Um, as I've already mentioned, we've got a dance showcase this weekend. Um, me and a couple of friends, we're doing the audio and lighting. Um, Luke is going to be coming and film it for me. Um, I'm going to be editing it and we're going to use that to help advise dance school and that. Um, we've had ups and downs with all of that. Um, oh boy, so, some of the... Um, it, it's been a bit fun, but it, it, it's getting there. It's all sorted now. This weekend's going to be fun because, as I've already mentioned, me and a couple of others are doing the audio, lighting, filming and that, but I'm also meant to be on stage a couple of times with a couple of my own dances um, with different people. So that one's going to be fun. Um, and then we've... <laughs> on stage and um, doing all that. That was actually a bit fun because I only mentioned it to Luke last week if he could film, because at first I was meant to be filming and I was meant to be on stage and it wasn't until last week it suddenly occurred to me wait a minute stage camera how am I going to do that? <laughs> and bear in mind we've had this going for a good three or four months now probably longer and it's only just occurred to me at that point that I couldn't film it stupid move so Luke's going to come do that and um, should be fun it's going to be my it's actually going to be my last performance for the dance school and this gave me a last performance for a couple of the older girls because um, they're off to uni too um, so that's it's a little bit upsetting but hey ho let's try and make it a good one um, other than that future plans have proven to be fun to try and figure out because um, me and Harry have been trying to start our own business um, Amped up events, sound hire, and basically doing live sound, things like that. Um, and it's having its ups and downs. I'm also wanting to do an IT part time job alongside it, like an apprenticeship or part time job or something like that. Um, at the moment, I need a job, like any job will do after this weekend. I'm doing serious job hunting, but I mean, I'll take any job, but ideally, I want a good IT job alongside it. But, around Hull at the moment, I've been looking at IT apprenticeships mainly at the moment, there's not that many going in Hull. Um, so, it looks like I might have to move away. But, eh, if that's a thing, that's a thing. Um, probably do me a bit of good, to be honest, to get away from all the nutty stuff that goes on around here. I'm forever trying to fix people's problems and I've probably caused several myself. Um, yeah, sorry, I should stop thinking about problems while I'm trying to do stuff like this. Uh, it's just, I'll stop thinking about what I meant to say to you lot and what I'm doing here. I end up 
getting sidetracked completely. Um, so yeah, so future based, hoping Man and Harry's business kicks off. And I left Facebook open and now I'm getting message calls. Just a minute. Ugh, I'm an idiot. Anyway, so yeah, that business is kicking up. Hopefully we can get some good things going on, get some gigs in, get some stuff done and just hire things out and that can start picking up. I want to try and get an IT job alongside it, preferably something... I'm quite enjoying my video work here, things like doing this, camera work, um, making videos, editing videos, I'm enjoying things like that. But I still enjoy doing other parts like networking, I'm slowly learning more of that, I'm enjoying that. Um, I want to get back into programming, I really do, I haven't done it properly for ages now. It's <laughs> quite funny because I used to be quite big on that a couple of years ago and I've just, I've just stopped. Which is really disappointing because I was really enjoying it and Will had got me to download Unity which was great for developing games and that. But yeah, I've just got to get back into it. Um, back to the leaving college as well. Um, I've left this part till near the end of the video. I mentioned it earlier on. Um, college has been... This is getting up sounding a bit like Becky's video here when she spoke about it a while last year. Um, but it has definitely been a life changer for me. Um, primary sucked. High school sucked. Life at home for a long time sucked. Life in general sucked, but since going to college, life at home has still been quite tricky at times, but I've really enjoyed how... I've enjoyed being at college. I have very few disputes. I've enjoyed being around people. I've enjoyed the teachers. I've enjoyed hanging with other students. I've enjoyed the work. Yes, I've moaned about it. Yes, you've heard me and Will and the others moan about our college work in other videos and that. Yes, sometimes it sucks. But it, if I was to be completely honest with you, yes, there are times where I hate it. Yes, there are times where I hate myself for leaving it till late and things like that. But it's been far better than high school work and at least I was doing what I wanted. That's the advantage of college. You do what you want. And White College has been a great place. I've made friends that I would I would do anything for. I would do anything for any of my friends, but also some of the friends I've made would do anything to help me. The fact is, th this has all been because of course, because I decided to go to White, I am so glad and of all the decisions in my life I have made, for myself that is, all the decisions I've made for myself, that is by far the best decision I've ever made. And I doubt there will ever be another decision I make that will ever be as good as idea as that. I mean, some of the... Even down to some of the stupid shit that we did. Like, at open evenings, take each other's shoes, I think it was Will's shoes. We threw... Becky threw them in the girls' toilets and he was walking around in some tiny high heels that someone had left in all the cupboards. Just... We were screwing around. And so the other things we've done, in the first year when I first met Adam, Dan, Becky, um... Oh, in IT, just throwing bananas at each other, screwing around, getting on, saying getting on with work, by that I mean leaving it till two days beforehand and then just blah on the keyboard. Um, the teachers as well, Joe and Kevin have been amazing. They're the reason that I was able to stay at White for three years. If it wasn't for them, I would have ended up going elsewhere. And to be completely honest, that would have sucked. The last two years, particularly last year, when it was Will, Dan and Becky, and a couple of others, it was just brilliant. Best, like, educational year of my life. 
just messing around at college, like, it's almost like we're at college to mess around, really. We, we got the work done, we've all come off with good grades. Um, I mean, I, me and Wilcock were D star, D star, D on our IT course, and both Dan and Becky did well last year. Um, but we just enjoyed it. Um, there was also other people like Dan and Luke and Brad and Rachel and Emmanuel and all the others on the badminton team. We just messed around. I mean, some of the laughs we had were just... College for me has been an absolute changer and I would not change a second of it, not even those late nighters on the night before staying up till one o'clock in the morning to get all my work done and then handing it in the next day only to find that we had an extension till next week so I didn't need to stay up half the night to get it all done. <laughs> even those, how much I raged in class, I would not change any of that. And so, if I, if I had to say anything to anyone, not that you're likely to pay any attention to some nerdy looking kid or kid, I'm 19 now, on the other side of YouTube who's a tiny channel, barely hit 200 subs, they've just dropped below as he released his 200 subs, subs <laughs> try that again, who just dropped below 200 subs as his 200 subs special went out. If you have the choice between sticking around somewhere or moving on, I would often say move on because yes sticking around can be good particularly if you're in a good place but if you've already like with me at Hazel I'd already been there five years and yeah mine was a city situation but say yours is good you might find that it might be refreshing to move forward but either way that's each to their own and I'm waffling on it's definitely been a change for me even people outside of college, so the friends there, I, I've really enjoyed hanging with some of you and doing some really stupid things at times and yeah, occasionally getting into trouble, but at the end of the day, we're all still alive, none of us are behind bars or doing anything, well, I'd say we're not doing anything stupid, but if really some of us just walking out the front door is stupid, just, it has been an absolute life changer and I don't know where my life's going next, but after college I'm looking forward to it. So <laughs> this has actually ended up being a bit deeper than what I actually wanted my first vlog to be. Um, I actually meant just to do an update and say, oh look, I've left college and yeah, looking for work, yeah, got a showcase this weekend and yeah, I'm just doing this, that and other, but... <laughs> I end up going a bit deeper than what I wanted. Yeah, my guard doesn't stay up very well all the time when I'm by myself. Oh boy. Well, in that case, I will leave it here. Um, thank you all for watching. Um, I am going to try and bring some new content to the channel. So it's not just games. There will still be games. But it's going to be vlogs too. And maybe, just maybe, I might be able to throw some other stuff in. I've got a few ideas yet that may be able to do. So, thank you all for watching and we'll see you next time. Hellfire, out. Okay, so I just forgot to say um, before I go that I didn't mention all my friends from college there and there was quite a lot I missed um, and there was a lot I could have said but I will be here for ages if I was to say all of it. So if any of you are watching and wondering he didn't mention me, there's a reason for that. An honest reason so there was only like the briefest of highlights I gave there so um, that's why and it's to all those watching too so um, if you're actually wanting to see more of my life for some reason I'm suddenly the vlogging seems a little bit self-centered um, then stick around anyway again so I'll do the outro again, seeing as though this is the second time I've added something on. Thank you all for watching, and we'll see you next time. Hellfire, out.